Hello Life Groups, I hope you're having a great time together today as we are just over the halfway point in our Heaven series. And I hope you've been enjoying this. I hope you've been having great conversations in your life groups as we contemplate um, what life will be like in eternity and in heaven. And this last week we talked about what we will be like in heaven, what we will look like, what our bodies will be like, will we eat, will we drink, what will we do, how will we spend our days. And um, I hope that you've enjoyed the, the information from this message. One of the things that I read that kind of um, made me chuckle and kind of stuck out in, in my studying for this message was um, Charles Spurgeon, Pastor Charles Spurgeon was talking about people asking him the question of will we be ourselves in heaven? Will we be our, our own identity in heaven? And he, and he said, I always think and point back to my good friend, John Ryland, who was also a, a pastor in, in the UK. And, and he said his wife would ask him this question, John, will you know me when you get to heaven? And his response would be, Betty, I know you very well here on earth, and I won't be a bigger fool once I get to heaven. So I certainly will know you uh, when I get there. And, and I think that pretty much sums it up. Heaven is perfection, where we will be so much better than we are here on earth. We will be perfect. And that's hard for us to wrap our minds around because perfection is something that doesn't exist in the fallen world where sin is present. But we will not have sin in heaven. We will not have temptation. We will not have all these things that get us off track. And as you talk today in your group, um, I, I've, I've created a couple questions that I hope will stir in you conversation about what life will be like and how we will act in heaven, what we will do in heaven on a daily basis and hopefully that will bring you encouragement and maybe give you some comfort um, for facing the future or maybe for someone that you've lost in the past. So I hope that you'll enjoy these questions together and I hope that you have a great week.